Hello people, uh, welcome to my new channel, which is called Tightlines featuring Cassie. Right, so this channel is um, something that I've thought about it for a long time, and finally uh, I found someone who might be interested in fishing, and definitely it's a lady, right? So it's just a way of um, letting you guys know that this channel or this video we are probably gonna do it once a month and of course once a month it's not because the lady has a uh, woman issues it's just very much of the type that is like we have a very good type once every month and so therefore we will focus on the time of the month that is really good and then we'll come out and hopefully um, do something and the lady can get a few fish and learn something and in a way that uh, we all know that this is very much a boys game so having a lady out here taking her away from the city uh, oh yeah and try to make it more ladylike for them right so uh, for myself I'm uh, quite a seasoned angler but for her Right, so no experience means like that, zero. And right now you can see that we are up already, anchor up. And so today, uh, we're just gonna be doing something very simple. I mean, any novice who comes out, who try this method, may have a high chance of getting some fish, right? And that is uh, sabiki fishing. So we have some of the rigs up there that's ready. And now uh, we will show it to you soon. Okay, so right now, uh, what we'll do is uh, we'll just show you what kind of sabiki rig that we will be using uh, for a starter like herself. Mm -hmm. And right now she's holding up. It's already pre-rigged. So what we actually use is this. Alright, I actually bought this um, quite some time ago at Beach Road in one of the shops there. I hardly doubt they are uh, selling right now uh, apart from Joe Fishing. So if you guys may want to use this, which I highly recommend, then uh, just head out to Joe Fishing. He should have something similar but not the exact same packaging like this right now, all right? This is pretty easy. So what I actually had is uh, I have a knot connected to a leader line here and all the way up here, there is a clip and you just clip it on and put your sabiki rig all the way down. And at the end of it, which I haven't had a sinker yet on, uh, you just put a sinker and then you can start fishing. So for a novice, I think this is a very simple setup to use and uh, quite a sure way of catching fish. So we will see how she performs later uh, at the location that we are here right now, right? And definitely, we do talk about beginner's luck and uh, lady's luck. So for her, I would say uh, we shall see if that really holds true in, um, in theory and in practical because most of the time, when we go fishing, sometimes you see that some guys just had all the luck, right? So we'll see if uh, how much it holds in content. So um, today we what we're gonna do is we're just gonna try out the factory build probably for like an hour. Both of us is going to do it at the same time, and probably in the next hour we're gonna try the improvised one, and we shall see how it really goes for today. All right, shall we? Okay, okay let's do it. It's kind of easy, right? Especially for a beginner. And uh, I think we have the uh, lady slug here as well as the beginner slug. Yay! 
So we're just gonna release this and um, go for the next drop. the same one again it's a bit oh yeah i think it's a bit bigger it's a bit bigger it probably grew and yeah we just released it five minutes ago then so dumb to buy again <laughs> <laughs> This is a black spotted tusk fish. But the teeth is blue. Yeah. The bone, the whole bone structure, the skeleton, is the same color as the teeth that you see. Light blue. Well, Even if the, after you cook it, it's just the way it is. So. Okay, we're just gonna let it go. And this is her number six. Same thing. You guess what yeah, it's the same one, the long one. Yeah, our score is uh, 8 to 1. I don't know what's wrong. <coughs> <coughs> I think I've given up for the day. Brother.
makes sense, right? So our score currently stands at 9 is to 1. How about that for a beginner, right? This is <laughs> this is the results that we had uh, at the top here. That's me. That's hers, right? And if you look further down, <laughs> that's mine. All right, um, that is using the factory-made Hayabusa Sabiki jigs. So you can probably see that uh, even though I'm not a novice angler, the the novice angler has beaten the seasoned angler up and down, left and right, all right? So right now, we are going to try out the self-improvised one that we made using the um, assist hooks from Shell. Okay, and we shall see how it goes. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna add some teasers. We didn't use this for the factory made, but we're gonna use this for the self-improvised. As, as you can see from the back here, Alright, so this is something that uh, we're going to try right now and we shall see how it goes. Self-improvisation has its pros and cons. Because when I do my own uh, drooper loop, I'm using probably a 20 pound or a 16 pound um, leader line so that I can actually target bigger fish. Um, I do not know, it could be um, those in the sur just below the surface like pelagics or probably even if I drop it all the way down for uh, the mersel uh, species. So, but if you really look at the, the thickness between the two of them, you will realize that uh, this, the factory build type, they are very thin and this can actually um, take more stress and you will have a little less worry when you have a big bite on this all right and then i did my own little um dripper loop knot and just loop them into the uh the knot the loop itself Okay, if you are really keen on buying these little ones, these assist hooks, which um, most of them use on their micro jigs, um, I actually bought them from Leo Haven, which is also down at Beach Road. Fish is all see, they're all busting. See, not see, not see, not see, not see. Yeah, I hear it, but I don't see it. Don't let it go, I'm gonna bite. Yeah, let it bite. This is not small fish, no. Huh? This is not small fish, no. See, 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 get ready, get ready. Yeah, 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 hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Oh my god, hurry up, hurry up, careful, careful, careful. careful. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Yeah, yeah, slowly, slowly crank, slowly crank. Just for the whole school, a bit at the bottom. Slowly fight, slowly fight. Oh my goodness, so funny. Okay, now we have to prepare for underwater shot. Underwater shot, huh?
Self improvised, baby. I know it's there. The fish there. Oh, yeah, a lot, a lot. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's tons of fish on the sound of. Oh. Yeah, fish, fish. Fish for sure. No, no, no. You, you just relax, just relax. And then you, you just let it do its thing until you see that it's not really pulling. Then you lift it up, then you pump it. Woohoo! Hey, why never in mine? What happened? It's not fair. What's oh, good? What's good? Is it good? Oh, look at that. Listen to that. Oh, it's another one. Oh, okay, this is Fahu. No wonder it's fighting so well. Oh. Yeah! Is it still recording? It is still recording. But we're gonna drop it in here. That's my pliers. Whatever it is. Wow! Okay. <laughs> Today we have a score sheet here mm -hmm. uh, in comparison with factory sabiki versus self improvised sabiki and uh, beginners versus the seasoned player and then take a look. Will it turn like mirror image? No, 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 it will not. Okay, so basically uh, you can see that we have a very clear winner down here, alright? Mm -hmm. The ladies lap and the uh, beginners lap is all on just this person beside me, okay? And even though I'm a seasoned uh, angler, I didn't do as expected, right? You guys probably think that, oh, I let water to her. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> okay, um, I would say that it's quite a good result considering that this is the first time on a serious fishing trip. Even though she has done her first sea trial just about less than three weeks back, but this is a good result. And of course, we have kept some fish for dinner, and um, 
I think that is it for today and look out for our next trip which will be in a month's time yes it will be the two of us again we will be doing something different uh, but quite related to what we have done today but just a step up and that should be um, some micro jigging as well as some more sabiki action depending on the condition right See you guys, bye! Wow. Okay. Hmm. I think before I started, I had like the perception that a fish can be that strong to like pull you overboard that kind. But then after getting all the small fishes, I realized that uh, it's actually quite easy to get them up. Lah. And subsequently, when we used the improvised version, I think we got a lot more like the bigger fishes. Which I feel I felt very happy over. Uh, I can bring home to my like grandmother for her to steam, <laughs> and uh, still manageable lah. Uh, but I'm looking forward to even bigger fishes. So.